welcome back to my channel. It's been a hot minute. Happy New Year. I just decided to film this video because I just wanted to and maybe I'm procrastinating work that I should be doing, but that's none of your business, so let's just get right into it. This is a recap of my first week of my last semester of college while running my business full time. I love creating this type of content, I love bringing you value, and for some reason you enjoy watching my life. Put me on in the background, split your screen, we can work together, put me on while you're working, something like that. This week on my calendar, I came back to school on Sunday night, got all moved in. Monday, I did some work. Don't remember what else I did. I think I probably got distracted and like hung out with my roommate or friends or something. I don't have classes on Mondays, so try to save that for like shallow work, business work, things like that. Tuesday, I had a meeting with my creative assistant, just talked about how her role is going to evolve her to leverage her zone of genius and make sure that her talent is bringing the most value to the business as possible. Had another meeting with some friends at Shopify in LA to get ready for some programming that I'm doing with them at the end of this month. Then I had a class called Beauty, which is a philosophy class on the study of sensation. Wednesday, no class again, so just like a deep work day. And then my mom came by, she dropped off my new phone. I got a new phone, she's gorgeous. When you think of a phone, this is what it looks like. You know what I mean? It's like, this is the phonest phone that I've ever seen. I celebrated my friend's birthday. We went to a very cute dinner. Thursday, I had a call with a client and one of my designers. It was awesome, it was a great project kickoff. I had a touch base with the developer who's doing our website refresh. Went to my motion design class, had my beauty class again, and then I had opportunity in the lean startup with my favorite professor. Quick shout out to, is he my favorite professor? I don't know. Check out Investing Simplified Professor G if you wanna learn more about like personal finance, investing. Friday, I had a meeting with my project manager, start the day off right. We just kind of recapped the week, plan the next week, talked about all the things we need to talk about. Class, so I have my capstone, which is like a senior project, big thing. And that's a three hour class, but we ended a little bit early. So it was more like two hours. Then I had a uh, spring training for my service project later that night. So literally been a jam packed week. Wow, I have something to do every single day at every time of the day. Or eating with friends or going to the gym. It's a lot. People are always like, I don't know how you do it. It's so cool that you're in school. It is cool. Literally running on caffeine and God's grace because I don't know how else I would do it. <laughs> Celebrating wins is so important. Got my new phone, not really a win, but like, I'm, I'll take it. This project that I was working on for a client, it was a mammoth of a project. The client freaked, like she loved it. So it made it worth it. I had a, an idea for my capstone project. Uh, I went to the gym three or four times this week, which with my schedule, that's amazing. I should probably check my journal, but I didn't write in my journal this week. So I should probably write in my journal, then check my journal as a reference. My parents got me this new journal. Another thing I got for Christmas, basketball shoes, because I'm playing intramural basketball this season at school. So I've been in the gym, I've been hooping, I'm in there. Not good, but having fun. Look, let's be real. The tea is, I know a lot of people who are not good at what they do and they make money from it in a business. So it's okay if I'm not good at basketball because I'm just doing it for fun. At least I'm not taking people's money. But yeah, honestly, it's been a really stressful week. Wait, I take it back. It's been a very busy week, not stressful. Because here's the thing about stress. This is a golden nugget, so make sure you're listening. You can choose whether or not you allow your situation to stress you out. Chew on that. You can decide whether or not to be stressed. Stress is a reaction to a situation and situations are gonna happen and nothing is gonna change that. Being stressed isn't gonna take the situation away and being stressed usually is gonna make it worse, not better. So I've been adopting the mindset of, shout out to one of my professors. He's actually really instilled this in us and I love him for it. Things are gonna happen, but I don't need to be stressed because that doesn't help me. That doesn't serve me. Stress is the silent killer. I don't need her in my life. Why would I allow it to stress me out? It's just life. I'm not gonna let it stress me out. I'm not trying to have a heart attack anytime soon or go gray and lose these luscious locks. So I'm not gonna stress. Now that I'm off my soapbox, also I just had to drink emergency because I got a little cold this week. So like really it's just been, it's been a doozy, but I'm excited. I'm lying, I'm not excited. I should be excited. I wanna be excited. It's my last semester in college. I'm not excited yet. Hopefully I can be excited. I'm just like looking at my schedule for next week and every, week and it's just a lot but just trying to take it one day at a time be present those things are going to happen regardless right let me preach at myself and just enjoy the ride thanks for listening thanks for tuning in can't wait to hear from you drop a comment about what's going on in your orbit lately or if you enjoyed any of this and hopefully see you soon